What is going on, guys and gals? Uh, I'm gonna upload a few tutorials today, if possible. I'm gonna start with this one. They're gonna be quick ones, but it's gonna go over a couple questions I've been asked after my last tutorials a few months ago. So I already showed many times how to make a quest. I'm not gonna do it again. So we've got a new quest called SSS Testing, okay? I'm gonna open this up. Um, I have it set to not start game enable. If you wanna do that with a sec file, it's very easy to do. There's tons of tutorials already on that. Uh, no sense in reinventing the wheel with another tutorial on it. So I'm going to go to stages. I want 0 through 40, and you'll see why I want 40 at the time. We are going to add to this in a second tutorial, but right now we're going to do dialogue choices. So this has been asked a few times. So, okay, so from here you want to go 0 on put startup stage. I'll show you just how to start the the quests with console commands right now. I'm gonna show you how to do with script, which was another question asked in a tutorial after this one. But, set objective displayed, copy here, and I will put these down below so you can just copy and paste them. We're gonna compile it. So, we do this because when you start the stage up, if you don't have some objective to be displayed, the quest will be running, but it won't show the quest is running. See what I mean? Hopefully that makes sense to you. So zero, and then we're gonna put uh, Sadia, Sadia has a question. I'm not going to put the alias and point to her. We know where Sadia is. We're not going to get into that again. I've got this on other tutorials. So now we're going to go to player dialogue. And let's start with here. We're going to go new. We're going to call this uh, Sadia question. So, and then when it goes to here, I'm going to remove the topic and I'm going to go to 01. And I'm going to show you another trick that once you start doing dialogue, will make it a lot quicker. So, if you go to the 1, because we're going to do other choices, I can copy this and go to new topic. And let's change this say to your question R. And you'll see what this is all going to mean in a minute. R, G, uh, and we'll go P, okay? Okay, so here we are with our three different things. So we're going to start here. You see the arrow. That means that's the one that always leads the conversation on. So we're going to start here, and we'll speak up to Sadie and say, you have a question for me. Whoops. So we're going to let this spin around for a second. We're going to go into here. And she is going to say, yes, what is your uh, yeah, favorite color? This is going to be simple. You can use this to change what is your favorite sexual position, what is your favorite body part, what, is your, what route do you want to go. This is going to give you the basis of how to make a legitimate choice and the dialogue will lead to that afterwards. So, um, we're gonna close this back down and go to conditions. We're gonna go to the get is ID and we got to open this up and find Sadia. And then the other thing we're gonna do, so the only time this dialogue can show up is uh, get stage and then we're gonna go SSS and it can only show on stage zero of testing so you don't have to use the say once because that usually doesn't work anyway um, so this will only on, can only be said on stage zero of this now the other thing we're going to do right here is you have these three say to G P and R we're going to go here we're going to add a link there's your G there's your P and there's your R there's you're going to be your three choices it's going to lead to. Nothing else. Get, well, we're going to put four subtitles. You don't have to if you're voicing it. But this will that make sure it shows us uh, what is said when we go in. Uh, if you don't have Fusro Da, there's other stuff you can do. But you should have that in any way if you're going to do this. But you're going to get the gist either way. So we're going to close that out. Um, and then the other thing we're going to do is use this priority. So over here, when you first go to speak with someone, you come up and they get a list of dialogue. And you're going to scroll up and down through. The priority is where this will go in the list. So we're going to put this at 90. That way it puts it high in the list. And um, 
that is there. So then over here, we're going to start with your response here will be green. And then here, we're going to put OK. And that's all she's going to say over here because there's no sense in her, like I said, keeping it simple for a tutorial. We're going to put goodbye. Actually, I didn't have to. We're going to take get only quest here. And we're going to copy it. We're going to put this down here and we're going to set this one to 10. We're going to compile, go to advance, rename the script so we can always find it because this is a test. So I'm going to remove this afterwards. Uh, we'll go test green. That would be that script name. So then over here, we're going to put, what was it? Oh, we got it right on there. We'll call this one pink. And then here, we'll do the same thing. Well, on this, we're going to put OK. We're going to hit goodbye. But this one, we're going to go to stage 20. Actually, I'm going to add three more stages too. Oh, yeah, no, we're not. Okay, I'm just sorry, I'm thinking ahead. Uh, this one is going to be test pink. That'll change the name of that. We'll get test pink. And then the third one is going to be what was this one? Red. And then put OK. And of course, if you're doing something a lot more advanced, which I'm sure you're going to be, it's not just going to be stupid colors. You're going to have reasons for certain stages to go through on a certain choice. But you're going to see why I'm doing the three different ones on the set stage here. So, and then here. So this is where you can make the choice count. So we're going to go test, oops, test. Red. Okay. So here we're going to go. Now we got this here. This should be all set. Did I actually hit the goodbye one on this one? I don't know if I did. I did. Okay. So we're not even going to set any more. Uh, I'm going to save it. Let's open it back up. Let's go back into here. And we're going to name this one answer. Answer. Oh my god, I can't type. There we go. Um, blah, 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 blah. Answer topic. Uh, and there are different ways to do this, but I'm going to do it this way just to show you an easy way. And another tutorial, hopefully, today, which should be you're going to see what I mean. of a different way to do it. That is, I'm going to show you how you can ask an NPC what the day of the week is, and she will answer. And then we'll go with pink. There we go. Okay. It doesn't matter if you do this or not, because we're only using the one. I don't know if I did it on all of them. It doesn't matter. So the first one we're going to do is red. So you're going to type back in this here, what was my favorite uh, color? And this one would be answered red. That was to be her answer. And go back to force. Yeah, there we go. Let me go back to my player dialog here. I don't even remember. I'm in such a rush to try to do these because I am short on time that this one is going to was at stage 30 was red. Okay, so we're going to go back to the answer red. Okay, yeah, I did that wrong, but that's how you get the point. So answer red, and then here, this is going to be, uh, get his ID is going to be, uh, yeah, Sadie again. I should have just copied it from the other one. Actually, you know what? We'll do that real quick just so I can 
going to be quicker. Going to be quicker overall. So go back into here, go back up to that one. Copy all conditions, cancel it. Back up to this one, because it's still going to Sadia. And then here, we're going to put this one is get stage 30. Okay. And goodbye, four subtitles, got it. Okay. There's one. You should by now understand uh, what this one is doing. Green was 10, right? Yeah. So right here, what, what was my favorite color? And she's going to say green. So this gave you an option and an outcome of how the outcome was going to work. Goodbye. And then set this one to 10. So it can only be said if you had said green in the beginning, this will give her the only dialogue option. And it only goes to Sadia on 10. There we go. And then we're going to go to pink. That was my favorite color. And it's going to be, uh, what the hell was it? Green, right? Oh, pink. Pink was this one. Yay. I'm not thinking straight. But anyways, you get the idea of what's happening here. Goodbye, four sassy. And we are going to add on to this. Uh, this one I need to switch to 20. So let's double check how everything works. So to explain it real quick, if you chose green, it sets stage to 10. So now on green is the only option when you ask my favorite color, she can only say it if it was set to stage 10, she'll say green. You can use this for many different ways. There is another way to use a randomizer, and I am going to show that in another tutorial. This was a quick one here. We will go into game real quick so you can see how this works. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. All right, guys, here we are in game. So I'm going to open up the console command. I'm going to hit set stage SSS, the name of the quest, testing to zero. Start a dialogue test. That's how you can start a quest to test it. Say hello to... Gellis, I have her with me because I'm still testing some Skyrim Shroud of Secret stuff. I still got, I got another update in a few weeks here. Come on okay, in. We kind of took the long Let trip, so I cut anything. a little bit of it out Take of there. Take a seat by the so fire and I'll send someone over. Right, here's Sadie. So, if, it's, this is started, if you need more food or drink, you have a speak to Hulda. Okay. What? What is your favorite color? Then it will come up with three choices. You get to choose. I will go with red. And then it should goodbye and she walks away. Now you can go back to her and the only dialogue... Mind your manners and pay your bills. What was my favorite color? Red. Because it went to that stage. I have a newfound respect for men. I hope this helped you guys out in making choices. Wear armor I will make another one soon, chafing. guys. Hopefully today. I plan on making a couple more. All right? Hopefully this helped.